And this lecture is about software as a service, which is also called SaaS. SaaS is a very well-known type of cloud computing platform. Most of you either heard about SaaS or might be already familiar with it. As you can notice in the cloud computing pyramid diagram, SaaS is at the top. SaaS is a software solution delivered as a service over the internet. SaaS software is typically licensed on a subscription basis. SaaS providers manage all the aspects of software, such as delivery and management, ensuring that service level agreement is maintained. For example, the software is available whenever or wherever the customer needs it and performs as per the service level agreement. SaaS software is mostly executed directly within a web browser. This feature of SaaS eliminates the need to install or download software in order to execute it. Regarding SaaS advantages, since SaaS is delivered over the internet, you don't need to deploy or install any software. It can be up and running very quickly and can scale as needed. The value proposition of SaaS is that it has enabled smaller or startup organizations to use or subscribe to costly SaaS software, such as CRM, ERP, HR, and many others, to help grow their business. Some examples of SaaS are Salesforce, Gmail, Microsoft Office 365, and Google Apps. To summarize, SaaS is delivered over the internet. It is typically licensed on a subscription basis. SaaS providers manage all aspects of delivery and management. SaaS software is executed mostly within a browser. No need to install any software for SaaS. It can be up and running very quickly, as typically no installation is needed on the client side. Also, since scalability is built into the architecture of SaaS software, it can quickly scale as needed.